So these people um, obviously <clears throat> take entertainment, which is the field that we find ourselves working in, which is exactly what we're doing right now. This is entertainment. Hello, everybody. This this is what you're doing. Not necessarily right now. I'll do a cartwheel <laughs> in a second. We, um. we, are, we are entertaining you from whatever it is that you either you you put side you put time aside to to, to watch yeah. or listen to this. Maybe this is on a secondary monitor. Uh, maybe maybe this is something you're using to procrastinate from doing your uni work. I don't know. Um, but you are here so that you can either listen to us. So we can can maybe give you some form of, of enjoyment. Now, if you've put that time aside to watch your favorite team, you can mute us. You don't need to listen to the commentary. Put it full screen. If you if you yeah. think if you think that that I am going to add something to your viewing, put some tunes on in the background. There uh, that. That is I feel like some people just need to be guided through the game. They, 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 they don't necessarily... Well, you can't really have a favorite team of a video <laughs> game if you need me to tell you what the fuck's no, happening. No, but I, I imagine that there is probably an element Fucking of that. Henry's got jockey. an interesting branch there. I like, guess that's, uh, that's all the only thing I can really point it to. Like they, they, Maybe they're, they're driving or they're at work. They just want to listen to what's going on. It's more of a sports broadcast style. Right. Which yeah, is well, fine. This isn't, but it really is, is the wrong tournament for that. Yeah, you've tuned yeah. in um, at the wrong time. Say. But, yeah. I, but I get it, and, and, I, and I, don't, I also get it as well. If you like, have only recently, but you, are, started. you are shouting to a void at that point. Yeah, because this, this is, really is the fifth one now. I don't think we can really push it home any further. There's only so many times you can remind people <laughs> that this is this is an alternative approach to a broadcast. Yeah. <laughs> but here's the thing. You know how I was describing one of it's my the only one cave, cave only people. Only one. Yes. Well, sure. that's what that these kind of humans this, are. They're I, fucking I, cave. Men. This is the only tournament you have. 50 just top tournaments fact, a year. I think there's four other CS tournaments live yeah. right now. <laughs> you have 50 like big tournaments a year, including the crossovers, right? Like there, there's plenty of the, the the normal stuff going on, and you've heard me scream and shout and go, "Oh dear!" Lots of times, like it, it's a bit. Different. I was four days ago breaking down live in the middle of matches, <laughs> shit for you. So you just were. shut the fuck up. We we're giving you live <laughs> streaming <laughs> analysis. Shut the fuck up. Your favorite team <laughs> of three days. All right. Well, anyway, we're focusing on that guy. A lot. But now but the Counter Strike has begun. We're back into it, and Virtus Pro with a solid approach here. That headshot might be enough here. Low HP Issa in a three versus two here. He'll be joined by Man 2, of course, but they've got a lot of work to do here. The PT50 is rattling off shots and Ooh. good positioning, and we'll be baiting in PHR into our lovely closing spots. And it's going to be 1-0 on their map pick on the T side of Trey, no less. And will we see the force by Chad? Maybe three scouts, that's an option. No, the they should, they, the they'll, they'll play fundamental. They'll save. It's an Lexi B move of the old with the Ents. Uh, they should save. If they force by, then it means that he's had influences from this newer team, which maybe he would not have had previously. So well, there's Alexi B going all, all in right, first. Alexi, what are we doing? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Last after freeze time as well. It's like, actually, you know what, boys? Change yeah, your mind. Actually, we'll, do you know what we thing will with, buy. Do you know that stuff is working for me all year? Yeah. I'm just going to move away from it. So that that will uh, pretend never happen. Well, we'll see. I mean, it's I like the fact they went for pistols instead. Like the three scouts, like definitely like got some legs to it. I haven't really seen it work too much on this map. If, well, especially on that. Those Although it should do on paper, obviously. Yeah, but the th the issue I think those scouts have is as soon as you lose, like as soon as like the, they get bomb like they just do a couple of smokes and yeah. like, the bombs down. You've only done like two tags, so that's like, well, we're not going to win the round off this. You save and then you do the same thing again and you do it again. <laughs> Where did that come from? I'm not sure, but I can't wait to use this photo against Jason. Oh, that's a cute. I'm so happy. That's pure joy. Unadulterated oh joy. Man 2 now actually mowing them down. No problem at all. And it looks like this round has fallen apart here. The pistols have prevailed. It's going to be PHR removed from the equation there, as we'll see. A pretty underwhelming finish from Virtus Pro. They had everything they needed there. The rifles, a bit of utility as well. Couldn't win the individual duels. Didn't even check the key positions towards hell. You gotta check your corners, Chad. Yeah, you can't lazy clear. That's one of the things. You can't just check now. it. You can't half arse it. You have to really commit no, to the check. No, you gotta make sure. You gotta make sure that you're doing things to 100%. Live your life to its fullest, ladies and gentlemen. Don't be fucking slack and get out there grab every day with both hands look yourself in the mirror and say you want to be the best version of yourself you know it is all a mental game that's how ridiculous life is that's how ridiculous everything is it's all about it's all about that narrative that you've got going on in your head what echo chamber are you dealing with who who's that voice in there is it is it a positive or is it a negative could be a few yeah you could be dealing with multiple personalities <laughs> And, well, Snatchy, he's feeling himself, that's for sure, Ooh, as he gets okay. a couple there. Damn. Not bad with the Desert Eagle, oh, barely oh. any utility. They've managed to get an AWP Hello. now, a five versus two. If Snatchy can get in position and stop the rotation, that'd be great. <laughs> They're not even going to need it. What has happened here? This is a brutal way to lose a round. You see the backflip Alexi beat That was great. <laughs> yeah. I love it. Uh, Very 1.6. Get him out of here. They need to increase that, right? Like, people should be get flying the back, back six back. feet. Yeah. Like, they should bring that back. And just for fun, you know, just why not? 
Like, it's more satisfying. Even if cool. you turn it up Doosh. by like 30, 40%, yeah, I just, don't think just it would. Let's make him fly all over the place. For those people who aren't aware, in 1.6, we had like animations, right? So if you headshot somebody, you'd have the same like and they'd, animation. They'd, 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 they could be really clunky. They'd actually fly into the wall, their little boots would just be sticking out of the <laughs> yeah. wall. So. Okay, okay, all right. All right <laughs> Maybe we could have like a bit I better. I feel like people would really cherish the memories of 1.6, but like when you so play. So many it, bugs and it, shit. Like, when you actually go back and play it, it's like, I can see why this died out. Like, Well, okay, so here's a couple of things that had going. So it had uh, what we would call like Russian walking, which was like, you're binding mouse wheels yeah, to crouch. I, I, I used to like that. that we used to play a lot of 1.6, like even when we were source players. But I used to like the well, Russian CZ, walking. CZ, when you like, played it, would have been the same. They same didn't, mechanic. They didn't have that in that. Really? CZ, yeah. I think they actually, they had the things you couldn't spam crouch anymore. They oh, had the first okay. one. Crouch, like, do you know that pause? Yeah, thing, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. They put that in. That was the first version, I think, to have that. Then there was uh, there was you there were certain boxes. So, for example, I'll use train. The big like lane walls on train, if we're talking like back alley, yeah. you could sit on the CT stairs with an AWP, like CT spawn stairs, and you could look under the wall to Ivy. Yeah, there'd be little gaps, yeah. right? Yeah, under the stairs. I remember that. that Flash one. bugs were you a crouch, thing. You crouch, you could see for. Yeah, like, and you go on it now, and it's like, it, it's cool, it's nostalgic, but there's a reason why there was only a, a small cult towards the end saying, 1.6 will kill CSGO, it's gonna be fine. It's there's a way. reason it wasn't objective though, right? It's because it, it, it basically captured people's youths. Like when you're a teenager, course, it was your obsession, course. right? It's so, like the WoW Classic, man. I mean, yeah, exactly. people, people are so desperate for that nostalgia <laughs> feeling that they're, they're still playing it now, doing it all over again. I mean, that's it. That I don't, like, because World of Warcraft is, is basically the same game, right? That they've just added new things and they've changed like how you would do questing and all that, like, but it's the same. Oh, the same. game, no, no, the game no? is, I mean, it, it, sure, there is, you know, the same fundamentals, but there is, it's such a different, okay. different experience. Well, I don't know, I, everything. I played World of Warcraft <laughs> until level 20, and then I, I <laughs> it's, it's really funny now, though, because this game is so old, and it was, you know, the resources were so non-existent mm. during WoW Classic, now, obviously, everyone's sussed out everything, so everyone, everyone knows the optimal way to play WoW Classic, so people are complaining, you know, it's just, everyone's just doing the same thing. So so everyone's in the same Everyone areas. knows exactly what you need to do. Like, right. it's like, okay, instead of leveling up with quests, you just take this class there. And now, every, of course, there's like 600 of them Game all developers just must running hate around. Us. What, that we solve everything? <laughs> like, no, they just must hate humans. Like, because, like, oh, you know, we want WoW Classic, we want this, we want that. And then they give them what they want. And then it's like, oh. oh a lot of people still loving it. Oh. Like, on that PvP grind. And, oh, dear, oh. Miku. It's going to find the ah! first, but jumping straight into the jaw snatch, he actually throws a. <laughs> Wild bullet into Miu on the descent on the cross what? as well. Tags another. Getting very frantic out there, but still VP with a lead somehow. So low. The walking dead at this another point. One. And 10 ah! seconds is remaining. And Valda, he knows he's got an advantage here, but that grenade might send him back. They're he flashbanged the challenge. Oh! oh, what a peak that was. Full white. Bomb down. And it's going to be surely a round for OG on? at this point. Snacks, he's a, a smart dude in these sort of situations, but with such low HP. I like that Mac 10. As soon as they touch the bomb, he'll have to go peek it. And that point, it, it falls apart, but he has found a bit of wiggle room here. Knowing Vald has taken a nade to the face as well, the HP is pretty equal. Mac 10 might come out on top here. He's going to hold his he's nerve. Gonna the feet. He's going to see the feet. We'll see who comes on top. It's going to be Snacks with the. Vald has a kit. Fancy oh, footwork. Oh, daddy o. That's not bad. Get the AK, mate. Don't worry about that. Yeah, that works even better. That works even better. Get that fucking. Everyone was like one oh. HP in the three versus two there. It they like there turned it around. Like you see that when it, like Brown Hall's cancels, rarely in my books go well. There was ten seconds left when Avaldo was having that fight, right? Yeah. So, God, they just got it down in the nick of time. Well played by Snacks as well. One versus two. Now they've broken OG's backsides. And a, and a reminder as well that this is Virtus Pro's map pick because Mirage was given to them by OG. Yes. And so this could very well be the fourth loss. 0-4 for the OG squad on their debut performance here at CS Great, Summit. great vetoing go, by VP. Like, these are two very good maps yeah, for them. Yeah, happy boys. Oh, it was a Finnish fan, Alex, that was tweeting shit at you. <laughs> Back to that guy? Oh. Well, the guy, the guy's last, he's, he looks like one of, he's another one of those fucking morons. Well, I mean, I'm sure there's plenty of them on the internet. You just, just don't have to give them the, your time of day because time is the most valuable resource. You don't get that one back. You can't, can't get any refunds or late injections of time. Yet. Oh, yet. Yet. Not yet. like that movie. There was that movie with uh, Justin, Justin. I actually kind of Simulator. enjoyed that one. Yeah. I, yeah, it was a pretty cool theme to the movie, right? You know that other movie that I really liked that I, I disappointed they didn't make a sequel, but it was the, the guy that could teleport. There's a bunch of people who could teleport. I forget the name of it. Someone uh, who, Sensate or no, that's not Six the one. something? Uh, no, that's not it at all. I liked uh, GC Jumper. That's it. That's the one. Oh, yeah. The, yeah, the, yeah. That, that's that's, that's that a really cool jumper. theme. That's, 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 that's time travel. Yeah, I forgot they, about Jumper. Yeah. Was it time travel? Yeah, I think so. You could I go thought back. they were just teleporting to... Oh, maybe you're right. Uh, yeah. No, they would send them back. They would, they would find the criminals and no, send them... No, you're thinking of Looper. 
I think at Looper. That's, Looper I'm, I'm thinking Bruce at Looper. Willis. That's exactly what I'm thinking. Looper, at Looper. with Bruce Willis. And Jumper was one though. They just Gordon teleporting all over Jason the world. Gordon. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm thinking. I'm thinking of Looper. Yes. yes. Yeah. Oh, and that's a brilliant movie. I love yeah, that, Looper. That's my, I really like that one. That was really cool. I want to watch The Irishman. Yes, Is that the new, the new gangster Robert film? De Niro one, right? With all yeah. the CGI. Young I heard Robert that it's a bit jarring because yeah. of the CGI. The way they describe it now is like a Scorsese swan song, which I guess is like you know, like it's just doing his his formula one last time with yeah. his old with his old boys. It makes sense. I, like, I, mean, I don't, I'm not complaining. Should we get some of those G2 guys over here if they're not doing it? Like I'm looking at Nexa. I'm looking at Hunter. See if you can steal one of them. I don't know. Like I'm gonna, I'm just gonna stare at Nexa and see if he see looks. If he, over yeah, see, see how that goes, and uh, we'll give uh, Alpha him out of the yeah. room. Yeah, yeah. See, see if he reacts. <laughs> Well, he's not going to react. VP yeah, suddenly smart. asserting their dominance so far. It's going to be a nice chunk of change in the back pocket, a full buy, 4-1. And as they look to send OG to a 0-4 scoreline in the tournament overall, Snatchy. Do we Are mention we the odds shots? yet? Uh, not yet. Betway.com providing the odds. And you, I think it was a slight it's... edge towards VP. Yeah, which after the first map and that comeback is probably not too surprising. That's why I thought when we fought the initial odds, right? It's just like, yeah. this is OG's third showing, you know? Like, can we, <laughs> why have they we don't, so we, we don't bet on Counter-Strike and we're not allowed to bet yeah. on Counter-Strike, so... If I did, though, I'd be... I'd be uh, I'd Loaded. Be You'd be a yeah. fucking rich man, wouldn't you? So it's Issa and Alexi aggressive. It's Valda anchoring in. It's the big man ting with the AWP in the, in the Roman and Doman. And uh, mm -hmm. then it's MBK doing the supporting. Roman and Doman. Sealing that one. Good smoke now towards Ivy. That will just delay this whole assault. Five and four. One minute remaining. Yes, indeed. Remember to send in your questions on Twitter. Any advice on no life? No longer refreshing my Twitter feed. <laughs> advice on, on life, relationships, love, physical intimacy. We'll kind of we'll address it all. Counter Strike is fine too, I suppose. Yeah, it's a little bit overdone, isn't it? <laughs> it has been a lot of that this year. Um, but either way, we'll see now the boys progressing towards Ivy. A rare advantage here for OG. You need to start stringing some rounds together. They managed to win out in the second round for Spy, but then lost to the Deagles in a convincing manner. Didn't find a single kill, I don't think. I think maybe one on the same. Oh, this is a big flat. Oh, dear. He was holding him. Hello, Sean. Oh, Cares now. Sean's put the baby in the bin and uh, has taken the spot on the chair. I'm excited. He's holding the mic like he's karaoke singing. Yeah, I'm, I'm very excited to come in today. I heard you, guys, you guys taught me a lot about the education system and the things that are wrong with it. Oh, okay. You've been oh, listening, have uh, you? Uh, been listening. You guys taught me about an important saying. I believe it was bros before hoes. Yes, that was the What one. are your thoughts on that? Do you, uh, do you believe in that philosophy or? It's a it's an interesting philosophy. Yeah. I mean, it's a. I see you're going to throw me right into the fire. <laughs> I just <laughs> wanted to see what your uh, thoughts on the down, whole situation I'm actually was. not. Clocked in yet? So no. Yeah, okay. Yeah, punches. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Punches. Right now, at any time. <laughs> Just a reminder. Well, I feel like you, you. It's a. It's a good conversation you're joining. We're having lots of good chats about relationships and personal issues. So, if there's anything Ooh. you'd like to talk about, Sean? Just please feel free. So, I was driving in and I was thinking we could play a game. What kind of game? So, I'm gonna list a career, and yeah. you guys are gonna decide which of you three would be the best at that career. Okay, okay. all right, fair enough. That sounds you like got any, got any Cleaning out septic tanks. Well, that'd be me. That'd be Chad. Chad's got sure, yeah. a very hands on kind of guy. In the I'd, film. I'd just end up trying to pay people to do it, or uh, me trying and to- I'd just be all flamboyant and <laughs> making loads of weird squeals. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so that's me, yep. The next one, Rodent, Rodent Exterminator. I'm taking that it. I, I like mean, rats. I don't mind rats. Oh, yeah, yeah Alex does it. like the rats, but you'd have to kill Henry them. He does right. seem like he might kill his own kind. <laughs> <but yeah. laughs> That's so I see where you're going with that one. Is this the build? You built this whole game up just to get that in there? <laughs> just <to> anyway, <laughs> call me a rat. <laughs> no, I, I don't like animals that aren't cute, to be honest. But I don't really like handling them or any way. So Big I think, yeah, yes. Alex can Ooh. definitely take okay. that one in the five on two now. And is there any more jobs, Sean? What else we got? Ooh, we got like the shysty businessman, you know, that's scheming behind. Well, it's obviously oh, Henry. I'd be uh, snitching and like, yeah, I'd be do I'd be doing some dodgy deals. Okay. Yeah. Like, who, who can we picture being like the next Jeff Bezos? Ooh, oh, I God. Don't... Well, I, I considering the way I manage my finances, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Entrepreneurial oh. machine now has started his own export business. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine me, like, like you know, from the grassroots, like trying to yeah. get packaging it? Like, guys, you got any cardboard boxes? Yeah, like, guys, right? anyone got like, any tape, like, just need any, like cornflake boxes. You got a Sharpie? I can use anything to do the label. Anyone seen a Sharpie laying around? Uh, we are going to be seeing the round go OG's way, so that's something. And what about uh, a police officer? Ooh, Ooh a police officer. Chad likes to be the referee. Gares. 
Yeah. Sean is Sean could be a, a, a cop, I reckon. Yeah, definitely. Like, yeah, he you know, might be actually like a like a, a crooked cop. I think though, it you know, was like, like a taking deals. that you were bullied a little bit in high school. So uh, <laughs> <laughs> time to assert some dominance. Yes, and I can really get get, get back at the world, <laughs> get some revenge. <laughs> Finally, I like that. Um, shout out to all the police out there. We do love you. Keep up the good oh, work. Yeah, keep the keeping the streets thank safe. You, thank uh, you. Anyway, this got awkward. Uh, yeah, you kind of did. <laughs> you changed, you changed the tone. <laughs> it was a joke. Ah, <laughs> uh, well, uh, Counter Strike and Headshot. Uh, any, any other jobs? Um, let's go with the barista. Seeing as it's top. Oh, Alex yeah, would be a good little. little yeah, that definitely. He, Alex. He'd have the conversation. Yeah, it'd, it'd take him forty-five that, minutes to make a coffee. Flirting with everyone comes yeah. in there. Yeah. yeah, whoever it is, very artistic. Make some friends. <laughs> yeah. And I like, get it right the names like, down in a fun way. Yeah, little drawings on the, drawings the, on the oh, cups. Oh, little goofs and yeah. little sketches. He's got a little apron on, big smile on his face. You know me. He's happy to be <laughs> you there. You know me. I look good in an apron too. I think you would actually. Oh, oh, the timing's a bit that off doesn't look good. for man too, and they have access to the site without oh, a single body. What's in it, man? Where is the hell? river of flames here. <laughs> it's causing all sorts of damage in MBK. MBK. All he's too on happy to apply. He's on for an ace. He's looking to close things out here. Give him his ace for OG under the banner. They're trying to give it to him. They did. They tried to. They did try. Doesn't happen though. OG yet to win a round here. What? Uh, oh, sorry, win a map, I should <laughs> say. Win a round, definitely. But win a map is, would be Contradicted accurate. actually yes. three seconds prior. <laughs> <laughs> I was kind of, uh, I had like three things going yeah, on my mind when I said yeah. that. I was going to ask Sean on the other career path. I was going to go with teacher. Teacher? Oh, a teacher. Ooh, Chad, you like to, to kind of educate the amount. No, of fuck that. No, I don't think he'd have much patience. I would uh, be. I don't know, I, I should be filling well. that role as well. It'd be more like a hosting sort of thing. If you're hosting a classroom. The way that people, the way that people, you know? like students talk to their teachers, man. Like, oof. I think Alex would be the best. Right? We did hear what Henry would say as Kerrigan yesterday. Oh yeah, yeah. that's yeah. true. He would be the best <laughs> in a role like a teacher. Yeah, I don't have a great amount of patience for that. We heard his motivational talks. Authoritarian. Authoritarian. Yeah. Uh, well, how about like uh, a religious character, say like a, a priest. Well, I could, I could, I could lead a cult. I think I uh, could come up with something like, like a group of oh, like twenty you, you people. Think you be, like more like a shaman. Yeah, or? I think. Yeah, exactly. Oh, okay. like, there be guide. different herbs. Henry, can you take news, us all out you know, to try ayahuasca? <laughs> Sorry. Can you take us all out into the Amazon I, to do I, ayahuasca? Ayahuasca. Um, I mean, maybe next August in the player break. We okay. have some time off. Okay. Um, we're all just gonna come back loopy. I feel like there's not really many opportunities apart from August these days. It's January, I suppose. You want to really up the ante. Sean, what are your plans for January? Could I have some time off? Yeah, probably some time out, time off in January. Yeah. yeah. Take some time off. Yeah. Family coming in late December. Okay, you got the that. full family Christmas. Well, he's got a kid. Then, right? He's got. Yeah, he's got. You, it's all you, fucked. This now. is probably like the the first Christmas you're. It is the first. Yeah. You, oh, it's the first since the baby came, right? So this is a big deal. This is this yes. is gonna be it's gonna be nuts. Huge. You got a big big tree. Uh, fake tree. Big fake tree. Same, same as last year. How Car hard? Carbon neutral though. How hard does you know? Jenna hit <laughs> we'll you? Use that. How hard does Jenna hit you when you fuck things up? What? I don't think Sean fucks domestic things violence. up. I follow Sean domestic is a violence. Domestic, domestic violence. violence. I, I follow actually. Sean. Get, is it, he's got everything under lock and key. Oh, he does okay. what he's told. Well. Gets it done. Delivers on all I'm just saying, Henry. I don't, I don't think he's dropping. I don't think he's dropping the ball. I don't know about your experience with with women, but you, you're still gonna fuck things up at some point. No, I don't think Sean does. Honestly. Okay. I feel like he's got like. You can't right. be as happy as I've he is. All out. Yeah, all right. I feel like he's got it under control. Sean, can you write a book about that then? Because I'd be really interested in reading that. Are most people writing their own books these days, or they have ghostwriters? Ghostwriter, if you just yeah. slap your picture on the front. I need of to it, find right? someone that can do that for me. Yeah, well, I'm down. You're gonna write Sean's gonna book. Write book. <laughs> 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 like, one, I could be. I could do. I'll do, I'll do the audiobook version. Okay. Right. Yeah. perspective. I'll, I'll, I'll read it out for you. I'm gonna try and do that next year. Let's see if I can get an audiobook oh. out. Oh, oh my god! Look at Alexi's oh. angle. Only going to get the first on the edge of the smoke, but still advantage OG and running out of time. 30 seconds and they've got no real grouping. Where's that bomb going? Is it going to come down pop? No, it looks like it's maneuvering towards main. They are starting they have their to, assault. They got to molly him forward, which they are going to do. But PHR wasn't in position and he's going to lose the fight. Now that's the round. That is the round. Not much to say about it. As we'll see, Snatchy potentially cause a bit of damage here. Eco territory for VP. And that will be all she wrote. So there it is. OG extending the lead now 64. Digging their heels in on train. Probably need double digits here, Chad. Does Dr. Disrespect live in California? I think so, yeah. 
I think he lives in Sean's neck of the woods. Yuri, he wants to come hang out. Get him on the dog and bone. Get him on the dog and bone. Uh, I doubt it, to be honest with you. Just signed, he, just, cool. he just signed a deal with a new TV show with the Walking Dead creators. Oh. How sick is that? That is ridiculously Walking cool, Dead yeah. Creators. Yeah, they've, they've, just signed, they've just signed up like two seasons of his own show. Like someone from The Walking Dead. Which one? You know, like someone that was probably like bitten, but trying to hide <laughs> that. <laughs> trying to hide around the fact. Uh, trying to hide no, it. I'm cool, man. It's sweaty and pale. Just like, yeah, you know, like I feel great. Actually, I don't yeah. know about you guys. This fever. I just feel, I don't know, it's, like, I feel really angry and aggressive uh, yeah. right now, but overall, oh, cool. don't worry about me, don't check my body for wounds. <laughs> <laughs> I always hate that dude in those zombie films, There's always one guy who's trying to hide it. Yeah, like, why is someone why being a selfish fuck? You're gonna fuck us all over here. Someone oh. just, being, just give it up. I'm just saying, if I was bitten, say, boys, I would, I'm on my own here. I'd kill myself I, I if I got bitten. I'd just kill myself. What, the straight up cross, if I got crossbows? Oh, like Sean's mum and Sean of the Dead, have you all seen that one? Yes, yeah, that, yeah oh, I do. Yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'm always like, come on, Deirdre, or whatever her name is. <laughs> Don't be that person who thinks you're getting cured. We've all seen enough zombie films to know you're fucked, it's all over. Don't let the people you love die just because you're being a selfish piece of shit. Yeah, they would want you to kill them, right? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? They're sneaking around. I'm 100% no, I'm cool, out. boys. I, don't know, I feel fine. Sean, like I've never seen you in a long <laughs> sleeve t shirt before. Yeah. You, what, is this a new style change? Yeah, actually. Yeah. <laughs> just wanted to. So I'm never going to show my full arms, entire, actually. Yeah, entire again. body, to be honest with you. Felt a little bit vulnerable. Double orbs, is that the answer, Henry? Dorps. Um, it has been known to work on train when all else fails. Yeah, well... Don't the... see it too often. Snacks I used to do as in VP a lot. They were one of the few teams that actually ran this consistently back in the, the glory days, actually. It was always Snacks that brought it out. So, interested to see what he can do. Known as a loose cannon in terms of his AWP style, especially on the CT side. Pretty loose right here. That was being facetious, ladies and gentlemen. He's being very passive. Indeed. But there is an aggressive CT. Oh, he's going to get spotted. CT and he got spotted. Yeah. Valda gets the info. Chad, if you wanted to stay clean shaven, would you have to shave every day? Yeah. Every single day? Yeah. Damn. I was thinking, I've been on like 10 days right now. This is like, this is how pathetic it looks, right? Yeah, you know, I haven't been clean shaven. Yours, this looks so heavy and dense. It's like, I haven't been that clean like shaven in like eight years. Eight years, wow. Damn. I shave once a week most. But I, I like looking disheveled. That's kind of my, kind of my thing. Man, too. <laughs> man to now. No, I was coming back. I had to, I had some more where that came from. I, my facial hair journey is starting to look a little less puby, so that's progress. A little yeah. less fluffy. Yours yeah. when yours looks fluffy, then it looks like pubes. Yeah, but we're not there at the moment. No, you're not I'm there. Maintaining a, a non puby stance at the moment, facially. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so anyway, anyway, anyway. <laughs> it's gonna be a <laughs> another kill, and they keep now? coming. Uh, uh, man uh, too. Uh. <laughs> Now, I'm not saying I, I dislike pubes on my face, just saying I don't want it to look like I I've, have pubes on my I've face. I've had your beard on my face. Yeah. Right? I don't ever want to go for that experience. It's PVA again. glued onto his face. It, yeah. No, it was makeup glue. It Sorry, wasn't, uh, it was It was proper glue. It yeah, was for but eyelashes. it wasn't the best application. Well, come on, Henry. It went mainly, the a lot of it went in my mouth. It was for charity. No, I, I appreciate it. He wins that. this. He wins. Oh, he doesn't. I'm happy to do it, but at the same time, like I felt ill the rest of the day. I swallowed a lot of your hair. Ooh. It was beard hair. Beard hair. And yeah. I washed it but very. But it essentially is pubes. Like when you feel the density of the hairs, you're like this is what my piece felt like. So <laughs> I was like, this, this. Is, uh, I just kept thinking, like, imagine if Chad does that. And then Trace and OJ <laughs> were both trying to wind me up. Oh, your mic's off right now, Sean. Oh, that's Hold right. Sean mic, we keep Sean's mic so live at all times. Right, so he needs to come in with little, all times. his little thoughts and insights every now and then. Tidbits, tidbits, bid tits, bid tits. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, OJ and Trace were like both telling me, oh yeah, we saw him like shave his pubes into it as well. He didn't tell you. Like, Would I do that to you? No, but they, they said they did. They were saying they did it as well, but they were being dead serious. I like, know he did it. You can't prove and it. And you've like, like swallowed half of this. See, here's the thing mustache. with OJ. When OJ comes around, who is a 40 year old man with two children and he's married, this is OJ. Uh, we faced him this morning. Yeah, we did. He becomes the biggest child. He is, he is, the pr he is a, a kid. Yeah. He's the lightning rod for dumb decisions, mainly for you for and nonsense, Trace, actually. Yeah. So when he's around, just a massive bean pole of a veg vegetarian, just bringing in all of this childlike energy. Yeah, and we carry it along with him. You guys are wrestling and shit. Yeah. I haven't wrestled since... I've, I've had multiple I, wrestles with OJ over my career. You know, Henry, I haven't really returned to the ring ever since I've pulled my back out body slamming you in uh, in Atlanta. What was the reason for body Why slamming? Why were you body slamming Henry? But, uh, it wasn't like so much as a body slam as I think we were kind of we started as a oh, fun fight. Oh, the lobby, wasn't the it? The lobby. No, that's a that's a famous fighting zone actually. Yeah. Me and DDK have had a few scraps in there. Yeah. You and like, DDK. Yeah, we've had a few wrestles. I really in there. pulled You've my back. A few out. There's, a, there's a lot of 
liquor being thrown around in that room wow. and uh, it's a nice open space and the lobby is like a carpeted area Lots of big room red to carpet maneuver, yeah. and it's soft so like once you get like a bit rough and tumble going on then you realize you can actually have proper wrestling matches where is this is it e-league uh atlanta the w hotel yeah and, oh yeah well, how much do you weigh honey? e-league don't hire me so fuck roughly like, like 180 pounds okay so i'm trying to do 180 pounds with just my lower back yeah lifting that yeah, I'm heavier entirely than Entirely with my lower back. Yeah. And then what, yeah, a lot of people pick me up and go, oh, God, I've really committed to this now. <laughs> <laughs> He's made of stone. Yeah. <laughs> OJ picked me up one time in Cologne when we were out and threw me on the bonnet of someone's car. Cool, I guess. I guess. Oh, Slammed you down. Actually, what's the number? Oh, 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 my God. Another stab in there as well, right? Yeah, I just, uh, nearly went down <laughs> and finished off. gets another one. One and a half kills with a knife. Not bad. What a risky so, maneuver. It's good to have him back in the server, I suppose. Bringing the... Uh, the fire? The fire, yeah. The knives? Henry, the maybe, you could, maybe you could send him your knife. Uh, I don't think anyone wants to buy that because... No, 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 just to use. Just to Tem use it for a week. Temporary. I, I would like to use it once, you know. I've had one evening with it. I'd like to have a few more. Oh. Classic knife. You're going to get some more knives very soon. Factory new. Very soon. Bought it uh, on the market, probably got ripped off to be honest with you. But uh, we've, got a, we've got a question submitted here from a uh, guy Go on. Matthew. Just Hold on. Wait Let's to see, see how this round the, goes. Yeah, this so is if they get the bomb down... If we get the opening kill, okay, doesn't oh, look good actually. On. That plant? incendiary will get a plant, but it will actually. Oh no! Yes. At the end of the round. Let's no see. armor though. It's gonna be real difficult. It's gonna have to take something hurt. absolutely ridiculous with eagles at this point. Yeah. They have to challenge. They can't just sit back and crossfires. They know they're getting pincered. Someone has to step up. It's going to be Valde to close things out. I think he knows it as well. There's the kill. Anyway, what was your question? Uh, how do you guys handle work stress? Any advice on getting stuff done while also being Stuff under it down with Brown is normally the way of stress. I'm going <laughs> to lean towards. <laughs> no, my, mine goes back to what I said before. I just, I just work more. Yeah, I do that too. Um, and then what I do is like when I'm not working, I will have like several days where I will not talk to another human being and just lock myself in a room. Uh, I think the my yeah my my take on that is that our experience of stress and our solutions for it are very niche and limited to yeah, our line really of work. Got no, just because you know, for example, we get bursts of you know three weeks of constant stress, and then you we get a oh, week. Oh, that's to, not good. Oh, for that's, that's blocking your teammates. It's a little bit of a late smoke now towards the brown halls. Yeah, I get you, Alex. I think that yeah, our our our, uh, our survival tools that we've created and manufactured are not going to work. And be universally mine, acceptable. Mine, uh, <laughs> like my, the days that I'm at my worst, like, is when I do like a really early travel day, and I just know that I'm like a massive cunt to like, like people who care about me. Yeah. Like I'm such a dick. Like, like a prickly, like a days. like a hedgehog. Yeah, like they'll say something which normally I like take as like banter or a joke or whatever, and I just fucking have a tantrum or something. You know? <laughs> I just have like a flashing out now. tantrum. Self-aware at least. No, I know, but the thing is, like, I do tell, you apologize after? Yeah, you just let it sit. There. No, but now, now with certain individuals, I tell them on the travel days, I'm like, just don't talk to me. Like, yeah, just not worth just it. Just wait till I get where I'm going. No, just, I get that. The, the the things I regret the most in terms of what I've said to people, definitely on those days when it's like five in the morning, you're in a taxi yeah. and yeah. someone's giving me some bullshit. Yeah. And it's like, look, mate, can you just can you just off? fuck? Off. I just give them hell and then I feel bad. Yeah. Yeah. You know, the whole the, the I just normally just pretend it didn't happen and just move on. But. No, so like, so recently, for example, I, I'm good friends with you guys know Alex Nair, right? Yes. And um, he made a joke. Uh, he knows that I work very. Oh, that's a nice push. He knows that I work very hard for his company, and uh, he made he made a joke. Uh, about about something along those lines, and I just fucking went all in on him. Gave I just him fucking everything. I gave him both help. barrels. Yeah, and then I felt really bad, so I said like, <gasps> "No, he had a shot, man. He really had a shot." Okay, hurry up, Chad. Sorry, you're all right. No, you're right. You're right. I sent 120 beers to the to the office to say sorry. So. <laughs> 120. Yeah. Did the math? What kind you? of beer? Uh, just some Kolsch. Kolsch, yeah. yeah. Nothing expensive. That's nice though. Yeah, no, because I just like. It, we were talking about a topic which is very sensitive, one that we've been vocal about recently. Sure, I um, And he made a joke about it, and um, I, f I flipped off a little bit, as I do. And Shoot first, ask questions later. Yeah. That's I'm very interested to know what the auto-sniper strategy would be. For I, this was oh. iconic on train at one point. I love it. It's, it Backtracks, just pumping away. All the smoke's boom, down, boom, boom, so you've got boom. straight lines to fire down. You know, it does make a lot boom, of sense. Boom, 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 boom. MBK. I hope he fires it so I can veterans. explain to everyone why we call it the Dak Dak in Australia. I like that the Dak Dak is so universally accepted. Dak, Dak, Dak. There it is. Lots of damage. Overwhelming at times. But here comes Mihu looking to find that fifth round. Oh, he's, he's in trouble off. though. Nathan's in trouble here. 
He's getting himself out of it by wiggling towards hell, for now at least, but he's got a lot to deal with. And they're all going to check the same position. That saluted them twice now. Yeah, I think that Molly coming in from the back lines thought that he fell in that direction. Dude, he's just running. Look at him go. He's going forward. He wants to Oh, Damn. that's unfortunate. Oh, a tag into the hip. Alexi, buh. 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 Can you do the full alphabet like that? Like, ah, buh, sir, uh, duh, buh. Eh, fuh, guh, huh. X go yeah. give it to you. He can, he, ooh, PHR all over the place, going back and forth and around and around we go. Where he stops, nobody knows. Krieg now. Now let's show, let's, let's draw on the map. Let's, uh, let's have some fun here. Let's show how it can be done. Let's show where he's going to be planting the bomb. Let's mark that up. Put an X there for us, DJ. Be planting here. Yeah, yeah. I wanted a red Let's X. show the rotation from Alexi. Let's show him going towards Pop Dog now and yeah. all the way through. Can we still do the timing thing? It tells you no, how long No, that's not there. No. Okay. I haven't re added that. I don't know what use this is going to be drawing on the map. No, nah, but... none really. No, but I don't I'm really know. glad that we counted down the days. <laughs> but... I wasn't sure why it was such a big deal. Like, uh, oh, uh, but yeah. I'm glad that he's got a, the, the, the functionality the back. The caster feeds never on no, the broadcast no. anyway. When is so... the caster ever having an opportunity to do it? The only people that can do it is like DJ. Yeah, I suppose. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. You're onto something there. I suppose. All I, right. No, maybe for like post and pre-match, it's a quick, easy tool for us. Like a low, low, low budget broadcast can you can I just go into game and draw that's nice can i pose a question to the viewers before we go to break sure. yes. all right guys tweet at us i want to know if anybody has uh, shut themselves in their adult years and we'll be back with the results after the break see you soon one of us has up to og versus pro it's half two and now the t side for the international squad is it half two i thought it was still pretty early in the morning well Oh dear. You like that one? You like that one? Alright, alright, alright. OG are on for their first map victory here at the tournament so far. Looking good. Currently sit 0 and 3. It, it, it looks good a few times though, Chad. It, it, looked, it looked good on Mirage. It was scrappy early, but then they made it really clean. Like VP it was 4 2, right? They yeah. were actually. VP came back. So there hasn't been too much coming out of the Virtus Pro camp on that team. There was a lot of like the situations, those 2v2s were they kind of seen towards yeah, the end. Yeah, HP, the round was pretty much done. It's wiggled the way back into it. Snacks does get a nice clean headshot though towards the lower ramp. It will be a final commitment towards his upper area. Dink towards Valdea upper. And, hit, well, that's actually the lower area. He'll be actually pushing forward now. Bombs planted. Big advantage for OG. They still have a bit of aggression here to work with. And uh, there's going to be smoking Manson removed. There's smoking a kit in play here. Ooh. Well, that might... Oh. Yeah. Oh. <clears throat> okay. I've got it, a Hmm. Interesting question for you guys. Why did the Scarecrow win an award? Um, is this like a riddle? Because he was outstanding in his field. Oh, that's, that's a pretty, pretty good. good one. I like that. Well, uh, send us your riddles. Yeah. You got good riddles? Send, send them in so we can Ooh, work them out. Riddles, right. The problem with riddles now is Google. Yeah, but like we're not going to have that available. They're going to no. send it to us, okay. and we're going to try and work yeah, them out. Okay. You know? But send I find the problem riddles. with asking other people to answer riddles is Google. Yeah. Sean, you got any riddles? Yeah, Sean will get us some riddles. We'll read them out when we need them. And so we'll see who can work them out first. OG planted, which we know means the, gal like the, with the, with the Galils can come out here. So we're going to see an AK for Valder, Galil in the hands of Mantu, a couple of Mac 10s and a CZ, a little bit of utility spread as well. So they could do a lot with this. They That's what Alexi used to do when he was on Ants. He used to do a lot of this opening stuff in towards, uh, in towards Olaf. Oh, not Ooh. clearing your corners and the rounds. A lot of that today. Dusted. A lot of that today. Yeah, so... I guess the problem with investing in an AK and a Galil and then doing a fast strat is if you just get obliterated out of the server like that, then your guns don't even get a chance it to meant, duel. It meant nothing. Yeah, right? they didn't even get a chance to fight. So maybe a different approach <laughs> next time? Going forward, yeah. Well, maybe it's, it's, it, mainly because they only invested in two, right? If they had a Galil across the board or something and then they went for something sure. fast, maybe then they wanted to brawl and biff with the rifles. But here, because it was like you, you've really put stock in two of the fraggers and you've taken that away instantly with the pace, you haven't given them any chance unless you find space. Yeah. Okay. But there was no space. I got the first riddle for you. Okay. Uh, the more you have of it, the less you see. Darkness. Yes. Nice one, Chad. First point on the board. That was quick. Nice, man. Yeah. Do you want to follow up on that? Yeah, you got it. Well, no, maybe not this. Well, it's actually this round's fine. You can have one riddle. Yeah. Go on. Is it a good one? Yeah, okay. Handpicked. I have cities, but no houses. I have mountains, but no trees. I have water, but no fish. Can you speak up a little bit? Yeah, yeah. I might have a little bit louder. All right. I have cities, but no houses. I have mountains, but no trees. I have water, but no fish. What am I? Um, a map. 
That's right. That's oh, great. Nice wow. work, Alex. Wow, Alex. That was one point for machine. Very quick. Mountains but no trees. Yeah. That yeah. That got okay. Me that's a good one. That was a nice riddle. So this was just a pistol upgrade from OG, which has turned quite interesting now as they found two kills, and they've been able to find a Fami. Snacks will equalize. So it's a 3v3. There's 50 seconds left. This is going to come down to if Mantu can isolate a 1v1 duel with that Famas and win it or not. Yeah, but still no Kevlar with it. Oh, he still did. He got the kill. Yeah, there we go. It's a start. Oh! Oh, he had a good shot as well. Veggie's got tagged down to 33. Good info. That's something. A bomb plant and a P250. That's a slight kick. chance. Oh, do you really want to play up up? Smoke's a they, possible. They can just oh. swear the bomb is done. But, like, if he gets... A you can find anything up here. That'd be good. I don't think there's anything. The only way that this... Like, so most people will probably try and smoke the bomb as opposed to a choke point, right? So you want to be smoking the bomb, ladies and gentlemen, at home as opposed to choke points nowadays because you're, you're hedging if you smoke the bomb. If you smoke a choke point, you're having a guess, right? So there you go. You see that? Now that means that Alexi has an opportunity. He could... Oh! Yeah. Unfortunate. But a good eco. Like a good pistol upgrade round. Good cash. But this is where VP can now really start to bring out the double orbs, I would imagine. There's plenty of money there. Snatchy will find his. Snack still has the orc, so he happy Me with that Me who could now. drop one across if they wanted that. Or they... He just dropped the M4 instead. Okay. Snatch, Snacks did, that is. He's keeping the, the orc. The orc, yes. Yeah. Okay, so we got two SGs. One for Valde, one for MBK. And the AWP for Mantu. He was doing some good stuff on Mirage in case he you was. guys missed it. He was fragging big. He's he was top fragging right now. Yep. Yeah, the biggest man ting. I'm not sure that's going to stick, Chad. Well, if you guys start saying it, maybe I don't it think will. I even oh. I want to start saying it. I don't, I don't think I'm really equipped to say it. <laughs> oh, he dropped a flash into it instead of a smoke. Oh, it's all great. He hasn't put out the molly. Well, it's Let's maybe see. worked out. There was a chance oh. for a kill. And we'll be here trying to open oh. things up. It's, not it's great. a blunder. <laughs> it's a blunder. <laughs> it's not the that's your way. catchphrase, isn't it, Chad? Yeah. There it is. Back into the round now. We'll see whether Snacks is... Up close position will find the bomb, it certainly oh does. And at this point, it's a bit of a scramble from the T side. They're actually positioned towards the back tracks. Did he run out of ammo? I think so. I didn't hear the click, definitely nice click, but. Or uh, it could have been a, a mouse wheel quick change. You know how those anymore. Come in. But uh, they know exactly where Mantu is at this point. And they've got the bomb, but it doesn't stop them peeking as we get down to the one I versus don't one. I like now. that knife animation. It's, it's very a bit jarring. jarring, but. Bomb's not in Mantu's grasp, and now PHR can just set himself up for success. The more time that's wasted here on the hunt from Mantu is going to be even more beneficial to PHR on this fight. Looks like he's actually taking an aggressive stance. He's not going <laughs> to not going to let that this bomb is be a hard picked round up. To win. Actually, there is a way. If he just keeps walking, does PHR stop he that bomb? He should see him, I think. Oh, the time! Go, 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 the go, timing! Go, go, go. Oh, lucky! Oh. Almost. Oh, didn't quite. He was still paranoid about Olaf. Surely they don't lose an 11-4 half. Surely they lost a 10-5. Yeah, Sean, you know, looks like you got a riddle ready. How far can you guys walk into the woods? Is that a question? Is that a riddle? Yes, that's a riddle. How far can you walk into the woods? That's it. I hate this riddle. Oh, uh, it's just like a play on words. How woods. Far? How far? How far can you walk into the woods? Into How far into the can woods? Into, walk into Alex the is on onto it. Well, we do have a technical issue right now, ladies and gentlemen. If you look at the, to the top right of your screen, we have a connection issue. Uh, so we will be doing riddles until this is, is solved. How far? Itself. How deep? Sorry. How far? How far can you walk into the woods? How far <laughs> can you walk? This is the into look into of the Talon's woods. Brains frying oh, hey. live on air. <laughs> the woods. The woods. woods. The woods. It, is it, it's not something stupid like the actual wood. It's not like, you know, you can't walk into wood. Should like just a man walks into woods. a bar. Um, can I have another 30 seconds, please, sure. sir? Thank you. How far can you walk into the room? Oh, you I'm going to hate us this. Struggling there. I'm going to really hate this. Um, I don't think I have it. No, me either. I don't think I've got any. We got, we got map and we got dark relatively quickly. Those yeah. two were quite, quite this quick. This one's so, so short. Yeah. Like it doesn't give you a lot to work with it's here. It's pretty simple. Go on then. Give it to us and we'll kind Halfway, of Halfway because then you're walking out of the woods. Uh, into. Okay. It was into that they were playing. We were all over it. Yeah. 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 It was. Damn. Sean, if, you need, if you're talking to the mic, we need you to talk just a little bit closer to it because uh, the viewers at home want to be able to hear you as well. Yes, sir. There That's lovely. Thank you very Ooh, much. Well, good, appreciate yeah. that. That's Sean Gaz. Sean Gaz. S E A N. Um, scene. 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 What travels all around the world but stays in the corner? 
stays in the corner. Now we're stomping them. All around the world. Okay, so let's not forget the ro the world rotates. We worked that one out. Yes. <laughs> so all around. If it, it stays, stays in the corner. Staying in the corner. What stays in the corner? <laughs> oh, oh my god, oh, it's snorting. a bit of a difficult one. Oh, was it, is it really? Yeah, a stamp. Oh, that's a good one, though. That's brilliant. That's a good, that's okay. a good yeah. one. I yeah. like yep. this one. Yeah. I don't hate that. Yeah, stamp. Um, it stays in the corner. So it looks like we had a bit of a server issue, ladies and gentlemen. I can see right now the players are rejoining, so we should be getting this one underway momentarily. So don't don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. Don't know what? Um, just your sets. This yeah. is the crew for today. Okay, we got any, got any more riddles? I do. Oh, Halvor's got one. Okay, how about step up, step up? Not the, not the, not the dancing movie. Step up. A great not movie. That. The first we one. We could do that as well. Yeah, man. Okay. We can have some challenges today. I think some physical challenges. Some physical yeah. challenges. Yeah. <laughs> you guys like missed my gymnastics to end the stream last night. There oh yeah, cartwheels. Kind of, I like. I did a cartwheel onto Kenny's ankle. Yeah. Um, <laughs> How is Kenny? Sure, let Henry do that. Yes, real. Sean is a big fan of my gymnastics. <laughs> uh, definitely, I'll be bringing him out this event, no. but maybe next year. All right, you know? so disappointed. You yeah. guys ready? Yeah. yeah. All right. You see a boat filled with people. It has not sunk, but when you look again, you don't see a single person on the boat. Why? You look at a boat. It's a submarine. <laughs> no, no, it's a boat. You look at a boat. You see people. <laughs> you look away. You see the boat, but no people. Uh, he didn't say you look. Did he say you look away? Can I have the? Can I have the? Ver can I have it again? Uh, you see a boat. Yeah. Filled with people. Yeah, filled with people. It has not sunk. It has not sunk. But when you look again, you don't see a single person on the boat. Why? The because they went downstairs. Inside? They went underneath. No, that's, just, that's not going to be it, is it? Well, exactly. That's Think like super logically. basic boat. There's no yeah it's multiple okay. floors. Okay. Yeah. The horizon. <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't know, I'm trying to, yeah, I'm yeah, trying no, to think. No, no, dude, I think outside the box a little bit, guys. Yeah, yeah, I like <laughs> that, I respect that. Uh, why have they gone? Where have they gone? People. Boat, the boat's gone? Of, the boat's a, just left the harbour? It's a different boat. No, you can see the boat. So. Oh, fuck, yeah. H has to be some kind of play on words, right? I think you're, you know, Sean's yeah. onto something here. Yeah, but then I keep, the thing is too long to be able to think about all the words included in it. Uh, you look, look again. A, you look again. Boat. Yeah. And you don't see a single person on the boat. You don't it's, it does he no, see them on the but boat. But there's lots of people on the boat. Yeah. The boat's full of people. So you don't see a single person, you see a boat full of people. Yeah. There you go. That's well, it. no, it's the why. <laughs> <laughs> <That's> <laughs> he just confirmed the question, though. No, yeah, because just there's a lot of people on the boat, no, not a single it. person. I see what you're saying, but I think that that's not... Is that it? It's it's not the answer I'm looking for, but... Oh. Might be a technicality, yeah? Fuck. It, it, it is a play on words. Okay, what is right, There is like some trickery with the words here. Go on, go on then. Yeah. Oh, oh production. production. Yeah. All right. Uh, production has it. Uh, yeah. Oh. Google yeah, the production. Yeah, they're all in relationships. Yeah. What was the Damn. Uh, they're all in relationships. They're all in relationships. None of them are single. Not okay. a single person. Uh, all right. Uh, yeah, that, that's... Uh, yeah, well, okay. fuck happy uh, people. Uh, what <laughs> asks but never answers? Asks but never answers. <sighs> I don't like this whole game we've got to do now. Yeah, now <laughs> now he just looks stupid on the yeah. internet. Asks but never answers. W watch Should Twitch chat get it in five seconds. There's a couple answers. They're just going to oh, Google, Google it. it yeah. Okay, well, but asks but never answers. See, this is where you can get snide and just throw somebody under the bus. Asks <laughs> but never answers. Who asks but never answers? Who hmm. asks? Desk hosts? <laughs> <laughs> it's it's technically <laughs> true. One <laughs> 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 of the answers in this thread is horny women in your local area. <laughs> 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 That's such a good one. Oh That's so layered as well. I love <laughs> oh, the one reference answer, there. The right? real answer is an one? owl. An owl. The owl. Uh, no who? who? Oh, yeah. God, I hate that one. <laughs> <laughs> um, can can the riddles. The, riddle, yeah, uh, the riddles are done. Riddles cancelled. Yeah. It's a nice idea. Yeah. Any uh, other challenges you got, Sean? Have you got any, like, we're trying to find some, like, some punishments, some, like, some punishments. games. Punishments? Yeah, the physical but activities, you know, Ooh. just, like, We're doing push-ups for every wrong answer? We really need that. a quiz going. And quiz. Yeah, what happened like to the quiz? Series. I was supposed to work on a quiz last the night. Could have done it. Yeah. Just, we forgot. What happened to that? <laughs> Tomorrow, we'll have a quiz. I feel like Saturday this is... Quiz. I'm starting to feel a trend Saturday, here from, Saturday from night from night quiz. <laughs> yeah, Saturday Yeah, get it for some at six. Yeah, no, I'll get it for tomorrow. I'll do my best. I'm going to get 10 questions. 10 questions, locked and loaded, with a point system, a graphic made. It's going to have everything. So uh, I will do my best. It's going to be a highlight for sure. Yeah, I forgot about that. All right. <laughs> my obligations. <laughs> the one thingy. Yeah. How about I ask you guys this? Who was the top fragger in the major finals of the first major? 
Yeah, um, take a guess. Oh, I had that at the tip of my tongue. Top yeah. fragger in the sure major you know final, the first major. Yeah, NIP so. versus Fnatic. Oh, in, the, in, the, in the grand final. Yeah. Uh, Wait, are we talking uh, JW maybe? It was so the team was JW, Flusher, Schneider, Pronax, Devil Walk. It was the best of three. Are we thinking out like single map or is it? If it would be overall over the three. no, the entire best. Yeah, um, entire it's a riddle. <laughs> no one was what? actually playing. It never existed. No. Uh, <laughs> it's it's never there was no first major. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's like the moon landing. It's I feel like it had to either be JW or like on like some real off chance it was Schneider. Like well, Flusher was like statistically the best exactly. major That's player. I'm thinking. Time, right, so but maybe it's him. But over like a like over. A I know, but like yeah, I guess the, the level of play was lower then. So he might have got crazy stats in the first few. Could matches, it have been like a super been an simple NIP one? Player? Yeah, I was about to say like could it have been just get right and force having like seventy frags and everyone else shitting the bed? I don't think so though. Uh, JW was the answer. There you go. Oh, I, that's what I said, so that's one point for me at least, I think. Sure. All right, so first half, ladies and gentlemen, in case you missed it, it was 11-4 in favor of OG. They're yet to win a round here on this T side. Now it looks like we're going to go for a contact inside play with one player lurking over towards main to potentially draw a little bit of attention. Ten rounds in a row on the CT side of OG, I think we are trying to show off there. <laughs> and an opening kill from BK. Here we go. Thank you to go. Oh, and one by one, they fold into the site. A hesitant the Alexi B. Weapon was back on Snax's grass, but they couldn't find the frag, and so now they're on their ass. Bomb will be planted. And VP, unlikely to be able to make too much of this one. They do have somewhat of a twist in this tail coming from Pop Dog, but it's being held. And so, yeah, unless me who's feeling raunchy gets like, the first. Like, why is nobody watching oil? Well, why is why did they plant the middle of Bomb Train? <laughs> what? Well, I don't what a question. I and the answers? Well, they're going to win the round, thank God. At what cost, though, Jad? <laughs> he could, he could, I was saying, oh. If he gets a double kill there, the plant, it could have been. There's a chance, yeah. Yeah, but not going to be the case. So, me so money in the bin now for VP. Yeah. Well, this is how it normally goes, right? Get a 5-0 get a start, then or 4 zero in this case. Lose one round, and down you go. Away you go. What was that animation? Kind of like you stab yourself in the hand. Yeah. That's Oops. funny. Yeah. I don't like the silliness in Candice, right? But that's the first sign of it to come. I'm sure the dance emotes will be out soon. <laughs> That'll be the next thing. You know you want to get your go to celebration on that. I don't like the silliness. Yeah, we're all going to like be having our different cool skins dabbing and stuff in the winning screen. There's going to be a bit of that, isn't there? Yeah, on the winning screen, there'll yeah, be funny like poses. Yeah, like choose your poses, oh, your victory ones. pose. There's going to be funny ones. Oh, the clowns yeah. on their little unicycles yeah. and stuff. <laughs> Glitter bombs going off, rainbows. It's all going to be a lot of interesting scenes, I'm sure. But for now, full eco for VP. In that difficult territory where you've got enough to buy next round, but you can't really just buy a single dollar. Need to take the pistols, and maybe a kill will come through. Maybe a couple! Uh, Rem, four found all as well. Right. This could be a bit interesting now. This is a kill. Nah. The dink, though. Didn't mind a little bit of a... A biff. donk. So I guess Veggie's going to hope Snacks can just draw their attention enough for him to catch one out. Snacks from main. Could work out well. He's got a Galil. Noise, isn't he? He's got a Galil as well. Oh, there's a door here. It's open. It's open. Sometimes you got to close a door to open a window. Huge oh! round for Veggie! Veggie! This is big, full eco, boys, and they know where the last player is as well. It's the AWP of Mantu. <laughs> really not the ideal weapon to take down players without armor. And at this stage, they've got two rifles. We'll go for the plant and see what he can do with it afterwards. The HE available to him, but trying to connect to Saigon so will backtrack. So he knows he's got no utility here. So that's a nice plant. Like, he actually has a pretty decent chance of winning yeah. this now. Um, but the problem is, if he does get backstabbed here, they, does he go towards connector? The second snacks. Star? Snacks. If snacks goes connector, that's that doesn't matter. He I know. Just gone pop. This is actually looking like I think Matthew's got it. Oh, he's so indecisive. It's eventually, the time he'll just, he'll just kill one worry. of them, and then he knows he have got kits either, right? But he's gonna have to worry about behind himself eventually, though, right? Like if he doesn't see anything. We this heard, is we heard one just there. This is pretty much now. They have to be the oh. Yeah, it's done. Yeah, you just jiggle for this. Oh. There yeah, we go. Yeah, Lovely play from Mantu, just stabilize for OG in an important, good. crucial round. He's actually managed to string two together, so let's not forget, that was an eco. I will remind you, that was Ooh. against a full eco from VP, and yet Veggie managed to get two with his heroics off the ladder, the M4, another two. So if you guys just look on the right-hand side of the screen right now, you can see that both Mihu and, and Snax didn't really have enough for full buys. Obviously, yeah. with the price drop of the Famous, it makes it more possible. But that's because they lost their first gun round, meaning they would have only had 1,400. Then in this round, they only get yes. 1,900. If so you lose the pistol, you get 1,900. Right? Yeah, so. so their loss bonus was starting from scratch, uh, and they didn't have much in reserve. Yeah, so. that's like the worst round to lose on yeah. the CD side. But well. Mantu is top fragged for them so far in both maps. He has, but he's down and out for now. 
looking to get back on their feet. They've given a couple away here on the CT side. VP will wait patiently for Valder, who starts to creep in towards inside. A lot of this play today. A lot of contact positioning from OG, but it's going to be Lexi B confirming at least the first frag here. They are going to commit towards inside. Is the bomb there yet? It is indeed, and Snacks surely goes oh, down wow. here. Great work of the FAMAS. That kill was so important for them. Damn, it looks so good for Alexi as well. Now, uh, not so great for him oh. and his squad. Bomb loose. PHR's AWP make sure of that and short work of the natural born killer. So now, this is going to be VP's ninth. We're going to go all the way here, folks. I'm yeah, feeling it. Yeah, we're going to go into a bit of a lull of the game right now because OG don't have enough money to buy back, right? So we should see like a save or two. Yes. Uh, I was wondering if Twitch chat, could, Twitch chat could help me. How do you spell that word you just said, Chad? Lull? Lull. How do you spell that? L-U-L-L. Okay, okay, okay. Oof, I shot the miss out. Still don't think it's enough. And we'll get ourselves the round on the board for VP. Lovely Cost him a stuff. couple of players. Uh, but as Chad mentioned, the money is going to be in a pretty precarious spot now for OG. It's like partial buy territory. Like you're going Deagle, maybe a couple of players with Kevlar. A few smokes in there. It Praying feels like down. with the lead they have, you don't need to fully invest right now. No, exactly. There's, there's no requirement to win this round. So CZs, Deagles. Yeah. If you go round for round from here on out, <laughs> you're going to win. And look at this. Look what they can buy to keep them honest. They've got a real shot at like an inside take here if they feel it. Two outside smokes. Oh, maybe not. Yeah, okay. Flashes over the top as well, trying to get Alexi out, but he's caught. He's had no success PHR's trying to get out of that position, has he? Ooh. Like, we watch Mouse Sports. Their entire opening was based off of that move. Yeah. And OG haven't even been able to get a player out. With, it with got Karakan out like every round, it felt yeah. like. Yeah. But one of the things that they were doing, I guess, was like I said, Carrigan was dropping his own smoke to extinguish their molly. And then he was going down into Olaf, dropping a molly back of six. And then there was the five lane smoke and the e box smoke as well as flashes. Which doesn't seem like too much. No, not really. Like not a lot to ask. And it has to be quite spawn based as well. Because if you have a bad spawn and you're going to try and take that, you're going to be late on that six train molly and you're probably dead for an we, over. We've got Snatchy here trying to get inside control alone. They want to get him posted if possible towards the upper hall. Normally Molotov landing around now on that spot. There it is. And at this point, you just see if the kill comes through. It costs yeah. you a lot of HP, but you can still re-peak it. It's just now it's a little bit uh, more troublesome considering he's low, and they'll be waiting for this just like that. Like, I don't think you should re-peak that without a flashbang coming through the window. No. Look, it, you, it's like we were talking about before with, like, lazy peaks. It's yeah. the same kind of thing. You throw that utility as part of your default, yeah. but maybe you don't expect someone to be brazen enough to actually be up exactly. there. But realistically, if you're tuned in and you're playing every round of counter well, as you the should... The default is you're only watching these two spots. Exactly. So that, that, that's all you're focused on. That's the only opportunity you'll get for kills right now. So why they wouldn't be watching it would just be a massive mistake. I don't like the re-peak, especially the low HP, but there it is. I have to try and reclaim territory. Yeah. Here to finally focus towards main entrance, and inside with the play once more should be completely wide open. No nades though, right? They use all their nades outside, yeah. so this inside play has to work. Well, they took down the AWP earlier, I guess, and I was like, well, that, that threat's oh, been shit. eradicated. Oh shit. There's a gap. Oh, this and he's so thread, bad. thread the needle between the defense of this bomb. It has been planted, but back is going to be turned. Don't shoot him. Ooh. Why would you shoot him? Yeah, he could have got real close. Knife so defused. much he could have done. Yeah. Well, it's still under control. Just totally. about a who, if, as soon as he fires a bullet, they defuse the bomb. He's on the wrong side of the map. He's so screwed. Like, like no box holes are clear now. As soon as he spotted, that's it. Defuse the bomb. Well, wow, either way now. Damn me, who? Solid hold. Alexi getting caught as well by PHR. That was, that was when things really started to spiral. Veggie's 4K round, right? Even though it meant to won the one the repercussions, two, right? Yeah, you got to think about the economical qualms that have been caused because of that whole scenario. But yeah, this is where OG, this is this is why I worry that there's not enough firepower in the team. Like, who's a playmaker on the squad? Valder, Mantu. Is Valder a playmaker? I don't mm. think Valder's a playmaker. He has been in the past. Yeah. He's not, not like, 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 historically, he's like more like a closer, you know? Like yeah, that's fair, that's he'll, fair. He'll, he'll, he's very good in the, the 1vx situations. He's like normally a safe pair of hands and two on twos. But like I'd say, more so in this lineup, we've seen more of that from him. Like we have such a small sample size. He's the one dust is one leading the charge. So that's mainly on the CT side. We really can't take much more <coughs> no, than that. No, of course. And this is they're playing a very loose game. Like they're just some basic fakes with contact plays is mainly the the aim of the game. It seems like and another contact towards inside. Just gonna go straight in there. A couple of smokes down. That's about it. No, and uh, it's looking okay. Like decent trades coming through. Oh. That shot, though, if the incendiary gets one tick off before the plant comes in, it's enough. Oh! Just about gets that bomb down. Now they've got a shot at this. OG, this is a must win. 2v2, bomb down. He's already at the bomb? And PHR is already on the bomb with a smoke and a kit.
That's a lot of pressure he can apply he at any, drop this. any moment. They just have to watch up now. Smoke, and he's on it. Five second timer is started. At? Two. Oh my god. One. Uh, oh. oh, just last second. That must have been zero point something. I don't know what Snatchy was looking for there. No, me either. You got the orb. Just watch up. You've smoked lower. You've got smoked the bomb. The only real threat of them having vision and swinging on you and having to was line upper, up was yeah. upper. Like they come out lower, they're, they're going to have to really commit and push through. You'll hear them. Yeah, that Mantu has won the 1v2. He was the top fragger in the first map, and he just won them that round there by hitting that kill. So the impact of the, the new boy, it's coming through, that's for sure. Well, that could be it. BP now give this round up. They'll have no money, and it will be match points as well. So OG well on their way to their first map victory as a lineup, as an org. However you want to break it down, but Snatch will open things up again. Snacks aggressive, of course, towards inside. He gets away with murder there. <sighs> That's such a naughty kill. He might even get out of this one. They're going to no! still challenge there. Not really aware that there was a vulnerability in the smoke. PHR waits patiently for the players to funnel through down towards the pop dog room. And in inside again, they really do favor this side of the map, don't they? I don't think they have, like, their, because their outside play hasn't worked at all. We've highlighted the fact that Lexi's been shut down every time he's tried to go Olaf. And that seems like that's all they've been out of work on so far. But this is the this is it, right? This is a mid-round situation, Valde, with two big kills. And that should be the round now, man. Surely. Too. Yeah, he can lock this one down. It's still going to be his responsibility. And Mihu, perhaps, going to slip the net. Oh, the timing. It's the timing. Just oh. enough for man to before he could tuck in on ramp, and that's crucial. OG looking to pick up their first map win of CS Summit. It's our second day. First map win ever, Alex. And first map win ever. Yeah, that's the way to put it. This is OG's, the, their fourth map ever, and this will be their first victory. Which, what would, what would their win percentage be, Chad? Not great, Alex. One quarter. <laughs> 25%. I like fractions. Oh, yeah, I was a sucker for a good, uh, what, what's, it, what's, what's it called? Um... What, the one at the bottom, they had num names for the number at the top and number at the bottom. I don't know. I wasn't very smart. Oh, I thought you liked fractions. No. I'm talking shit. Dodecahedron. That's I what hate it was called. <laughs> I think that's a ten-sided shape, isn't it? I don't know. God, I'd, look, isn't it? This is the school power is, of school. School is really important, guys. Um, yeah, you'll, remember, you'll, you'll get taught loads of things that you, you won't really. So most of the stuff I learn in school, I put into application after school. Yeah, I'd right? say so. Which obviously makes sense, but in school it didn't actually resonate with me. Like a lot of like stuff to do with the English language, it only really stuck with me when I had to write like articles about Counter Strike. Yeah, it came back. And like the maths ones only really came to play when I was plumbing, so Big Frag, Valder, one step to their first map win. That's what I'm talking about. Should numerator and denominator. Inside play again. Four uh, players there. CZ though, oh, oh, this could be the comeback trail. The, the low HP though on veggies are towards the spool right now. I don't think they'll spam it. They're just gonna wait for the smoke to fade and walk. Yep, here we go. Snatchy already does good damage. He actually gets the full kill. That's one of the more healthy They're members. Not clearing it now. And still not clearing the spool. Veggie can get a freebie. And the flank. Look at the pressure. It's gonna be a real problem for Alexi now. And that's and two. That's good. Oh, the gap. There's the, that's the gap. And he didn't hear the player lower. 25 seconds. That was the over. moment. That was it. It uh, doesn't work out for them. Three rounds oh. on the CT side with full buys. Doesn't seem like that much of a tall order, to be honest with you. But they do save the AK-47. The AK there will be some compromises in the buy overall, but uh, it's much better than it was before. Yeah, I would save if I was OG. There's no... Like, I'd do an upgrade of pistols. But there's no rush to go... Oh, no, that's enough. The virus will go 2K. He, he can... Uh, yeah, it's okay. It's still a partial buy. Okay, so if everyone else... He's just trying to make sure they, they get the bomb down this round yeah. and they get, like, three kills, maybe. What do you guys feel about the trash compactor type thing in the kitchen sinks in America? What, the... The, 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 the trash disposal, whatever it is. You know, you put the food scraps disposal. down there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I yeah. know what you mean. Yeah, I've never used it. I've had it in a few Airbnbs. Never, yeah, they make some funny noises. And well, they're hugely Ooh, here we go. They're hugely unsafe. That's why they don't have them in most places. Yeah, it always scares world. me thinking about people putting their fingers in them. But we'll see now if we've got a closing round. Valdir gets the opening couple of kills. And it looks like this 4 and 2 could be all she wrote oh, as... Whiff, whiff, oh, whiff, whiff. me you. Valder. I thought he had the info that was one close instead. The round's just been dissolved in a matter of seconds. Like a... Effervescent tablet. Feels likely that they'll probably just go back towards inside uh, based on all the other rounds that they've been winning thus far. Thing is, they could do like a fake towards inner to draw a second player and then put pressure on Ivy, which should become the weak point. And then from there, they just need to make sure that they trade out efficiently. Can't be overtime. It could be. It can't be. Why not? I just, I just, 
Don't want to imagine disbelief. a world where they give this one up. Yeah, it would suck for them, wouldn't it, if they're unable to close? No, you, they've still got games to play here, but like, the biggest zero requires pretty much any chance of playoffs, like, done. They play G2 yeah. next, so that'll be one of uh, everyone's favorites. OG G2, could be exciting to see those two head to head, and PHR actually doesn't seem to be too hot and bothered, despite the flames forcing him forwards. That must have been a weird timing on those Molotovs though, right? Because the one to keep him in place, or flush him out depending, didn't feel like it was timed with the initial Molotov? No, perhaps a little dis disorganized at this point. OG haven't had too much time to refine, and now Train, not the easiest map. Perhaps that was part of the VP thought process. No the smokes. Shot, you got to hit those. It's just contact, that's all it is. All this is oh my god. All starting to fall apart. Not oh, the most tactical it. game of CS. No one's saying that. They're not even using grenades. And yet, still favorite team for some. <laughs> even Betway. <laughs> Throw back again. <laughs> that individual. My favorite team. <laughs> As they complete their third map. Oh, good shot from Mantu. Good shot, but not really. Too much of a shot in the round now, maybe. Issa dropping. And his body drops alongside his teammates. And so OT I mean, that Henry whispered about does seem to be on the cards. The cash I mean, is a little wonky. As well. All right, guys, take a time out right now. Let's talk this one through here. We got to uh, we got to come up with a solution here, boys. We can't be doing Problem any is of this bloody they'll nonsense. They'll stay on the T side as well. Do they? They don't have a coach, do they? I don't uh, think so. No. no. How much money OG have? I guess I'm maybe working it out. I could use a new job. You want to be a coach? Well, it depends on how much money they have. Uh, it is my MP5 for MBK. Don't love to see it. Don't you see about two of those patches of tournaments? So is this the one that saves them? Okay, so just flashes, no five lane smoke. Uh, or there could have been a five lane smoke. We don't. There was a. Five lane. Okay, so they have the opening kill. They have the four v five advantage. They have the power play scenario. How will they drop the ball this time, ladies and gentlemen? Tune in to find out. Well, this, this is the reaction. <gasps> Mihu, this is huge. Yeah. Oh, he spotted him. Good intuition from Issa to jiggle that. That could have been a nightmare. He goes down with the smoke in his hand as well. Whoa. This Absolutely is where awesome the the prep that they've done comes into play, right? Because the mid-round reaction they have now after knowing that the Ivy player spotted them. Mihu hasn't even worried about Ivy anymore. Look at him. He's just legged it all the way back and given up that part of the map. And they're just playing a 2-2 two, two in forward positions. OG will be scared to re-aggress on that part because they have so much to clear. Which means that Mihu just showing himself has forced OG into this. And that does seem to be the start. Balda, however, trading things out, does keep the advantage firmly in the grasp of OG. 40 seconds. Could be the end here. OG with the man advantage. They've got no more grenades, but they do have the firepower. Oh, oh yeah. he's found another opening here. This the little... He can stop this. He can come. Oh, he does get tagged, but it doesn't deter him. He goes forward and won't find another. 30 seconds, the bomb's no loose. No more nades. Veggie and Snatchy. <laughs> Oh, they can really heal, hold them at arm's length. Time. It's over feeling time. it. It's over time. I'm not sure. I still think there's a chance. It's over time. A scrappy finish, but they'll get the job done. It's over time. It looks good. Oh, well, it is over time, and that's not gone well at all. It is going to be 10k. 11 uh, rounds. Another overtime here. We hadn't seen one until today. So many leads forged. And squandered. The, the reason I'm disappointed is because I kind of want OG just to get the win out the way. You know, like <laughs> get that first win out of the way so that then maybe they know that they can actually do it. Because that's yeah. a big thing, right? Actually being able to get the victories on the board. So I, I'm glad it's a competitive match. I'm glad that we're getting <laughs> overtime in all the rounds and, and, and all that kind of stuff. Because it was 16-14, Mirage, no? Uh, no, uh, that went overtime. That went overtime, yeah, sorry, 19-15. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. so like, but this right here is where I worry about OG because this is environments they've never been in in a team before. Like, this is their first official, so now we have to worry about their first overtimes. And on Mirage, didn't go well at all. <coughs> Not even a little bit. Which was their pick, and it's evident they haven't really played this map too much. This looks like they have no t straps They're just like, they all know the smokes, but they just can't coordinate them right now. It's a lot of default plays and just contact together, which is fine, it can work. It's just not going to take down a well-drilled team. But it's probably haven't necessarily looked world-class themselves, but they're, they are holding them off long enough to get to overtime, and this is where they'll have the advantage on the CT side, considering the lack of structure for OG we've seen so far. But they've got the better individual, I'd say, pound for pound, as MBK will open things up. Nice headshot. Veggie, though, looking to cause another disaster as he hears the footsteps, but it's going to be another player behind him. That's going to be Mantu, who's looking to make this one a clean sweep. Fixing the shiny bayonet onto the front of his rifle and won't be able to find a second MBK ensuring that those angles are hard to adjust. So we have got the first round for OG and this is always that 
pesky round that was eluding you for so many rounds in the previous regulation, but yeah. into overtime you find it clean. A brutal and uh, sobering moment, but it's OG still finding their footing on this T side. And Train's a very expensive map. It's when you have all the incendiaries, the snipers, you can see their money is going to be a bit of an issue, but they will get an extra bit of an injection. Snacks might as well save the M4. I really hope when we see OG play against G2 in the next games that we see more from the other names in the team because I don't like the fact that Mantu seems to be the one getting it done. Yeah. I don't like that doesn't sit well with me for this squad. Well, it's certainly not how you would you would be describing it when they were contending for no. a, for a top placement. No, like it's not I don't have a problem with him being a good fragger. Like I don't have any issues with that at all. You just would expect for the names in the server he should not come in and be the one delivering the clutch moments, winning out those kind of scenarios for this team. Saving like, you with that sick catch on the back. He should yeah. have a pedigree within this squad to rely on these, yeah. these names. Yeah, you know? Yeah, certainly. And I mean, <coughs> Issa as well is a conversation in itself because I think, you know, in, in HR... Uh, he was often just, just kind yeah. of give a fix with that tag of being like, you know, the ride or die entry only, fragger. This is the fourth map. We haven't really seen much from much, him. Much, yeah. No. Certainly on the T side. Mirage, this is he was walking out A-Ramp killing he people. Was, he was, he was, he was. But now he's been left to his own devices like Ivy sometimes, and he doesn't necessarily have too much ground covered there. So early utility pulled out of the CTs. Valder's going to just play on the other side of it. Look, that smoke really it's is isolated. Smoke. Damn. Someone, someone learned that for our games. Yeah, that would achieve a lot. Yeah, it gives you the avenue of approach. You want to get aggressive. Stops them getting down the ramp in general, and but so see, will that. What's like? What's the is it? Is it just walk out and get killed? That's, I don't understand. That's what they're going for here, which is, I guess, understandable. They're not going to say they're doing otherwise. Yeah, you're right. I mean, they're, they're happy to admit they haven't played really at all. But you should like they should know what that means now, right? So they have that Ivy kill. It's a four v four. They should know what that means in the context of this game. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, there should be some sort of... Uh, is it one player just pushing inside again? Is that Valder? Yeah, he's walked down low up on his own. <laughs> he's so just it's a, in. Like... And no one knows. So so what's going to happen now? The low ramp smoke's going to clear. Uh, he's, Alexi's going to die right now because the box holes push is coming through. This is this timing is fucked. There's still MBK keeping them in the round at least. Oh, dear. Oh, if Snacks, Snacks is going to wait a second. Oh, and he's going to get both of them. Oh, the spray's not neat, but it doesn't matter. And Don't that round just that. gets ripped. They just said, you see they got that, like really valuable real estate, but it's just like you see, like, what do we do now? Like, they're just waiting for what, Valor to walk and connect to, like, that's going to take, what, 30 seconds Six at that years. point? <laughs> like, it was a nice idea, like, good map found, but it's like Snacks has read them so well. He came down, spots the first player, already spotted Valder as well. Nice spray connection. Big round to pick up and an advantage thrown away. And most of their rounds have ended inside, right? So of course they're going to be playing heavier people, like heavier players towards that side of the map. I think Snacks' aggression there, you can't really account for that. That was good timing, but still, when you have the room, you got to use it. Yeah, Ooh. had they done that together, it would have been great. There's one guy though having to wait for everyone to transition over. It was just going to take too long. Well, final round of the first half of overtime here. 1-1. One, one. Money okay on both teams. Ivy aggression again, so they're about to get full info that's about to be inside. They can rotate two players over if they really want. Me who's they, going for it. But they always push someone back from pop when they're going for an inner push, right? So they could even have a third player rotate over towards inner now because he's about to clear this position. Now they can rotate another player inside. Has to be inside again. Like that, that pop dog smoke especially. They've known no one's in T-spawn. They just have to go for this. Yeah. There's no other option. This is it. This is an all-in. So unless they can get a kill or two here and then drop back. That's it. That's... Not good enough that is the well. round, I think, yeah. If there's so much defaults, time, but... There's still a player in pop. You can't go back. You have to go in. You know that there's a flank coming in from Mihu, so the pressure's constantly being applied. And that'll be it. This is not looking good. Well, it is a 2-1. At least we got a single round on the board there. But, uh, yeah, there's every chance the VP just win the first round in the second half. With an execution off the bat, it'll be difficult to contain. And uh, they'll have the pressure on their side of the server. I would say they need it. At least two there, but still, at least they got the one. It is Mantu at the very top, looking great. Here's the extra stats for you. Utility damage, pretty high on Valdo and XCB. And uh, that's about as interesting as it gets for them. 30 frags at the top. Utility damage, you've got some front runners there. Just two, Valdo and Alexi, been throwing those powerful nades in the server. And imp impressively, Snatchy hasn't got a single point of utility damage. Yeah, just holding wow. true with the sniper. Yeah, no he's a ride or die. AWP player. So their CT side was good, right? They did a lot of locking out, but I think VP found themselves in a bunch of like 2v2s, 3v2s, those kind of situations that maybe if they can get themselves into again, they could win now that they're warmed into the game a bit more. So... Ooh, okay.
Okay. They're very strung out in this setup as well, though. If have a look at it. Like, if Issa misses and he dies, no trade potential. The Pop-Dog guy completely on his own. The Ivy guy completely on his own. Like, they're not linked up at all. There's not any, like, pop like, flash potential or anything like that. So those 1v1s are being given and taken at this point. Miu got first. Now MBK has to really multi-kill here. And on his return, distribute some good damage. But a double now for Miu on the flank is Valder. And perfect timing to catch Snacks. Uh, exposed, so this could very well be the equalizer. Snatchy though thrust into a one versus three scenario. So much time and very spread out CT positions. Oh, he's not ready for this. Oh, man, two. Closing the gap. Ready and waiting. And now we could be poised for a two round run. OG would have to have a seamless CT side here though in order to pick it up in our first OT. Mm. What, what can VP do here? They used to be known for their outside brutal pushes, the fast main yeah. entrances, but obviously completely different lineup. But maybe some of the old DNA resides within. Snacksy. They're doing just a five-man interplay here. Yeah, I guess. Well, yeah, it's, it's all five dudes straight in. Yeah, you can't really waste any time here. Pretty much commit oh, within 20 Oh, that smoke seconds. is going to unravel this. They have to go through it. They have to go. Oh, the timing on this. Go, That's go, it. Go. That's the round. Look at the rotation. They're completely They've locked this out. Off. They've locked it out. Yeah, it lands at the right time as well. He can't even get out. And the, look at all the nades left for VP right now, right? They yeah. can just hold this off. They don't need to do anything dumb. It's they can done. smoke CT. They're they right. can smoke everything. Oh, it's a perfect smoke as well. Like, this is their round of throwaway. Just use your Molotovs, boys. Relax. Step back. You don't even need to take a single Stand fight. Stand down. Use your nades. Use your nades. Stand down. What are you <laughs> doing? Oh, dude. Why? How have you given that one up? I don't get it. <laughs> Like, all you had to do is sit there with the Molotovs and the smokes, and it's done. <gasps> Not Snatchy bad. Mod oh, still got a chance of this smoke. Okay. Like, if he wins this, Please play. win it, Snatchy. Oh, good effort. A good shot, yeah. Oh, they've... Oh. Wow. Oh, they actually gave that round up. How do you fuck that one up? <laughs> I don't know. They were like, they realized they, they chose the wrong nades. They got real close. It was like, it was the worst of both worlds there. They go super close with the utility down, still had all the Molotovs and Smokes available to them, then put up flashbangs, looking to get aggressive and get themselves out of danger, then got caught with the flashes in hand and didn't really. It just sat at the back across fires with Molotovs out. They're, it's done. Oh, MBK obviously had to make those kills, but it just felt like. They they got lucky that they killed <coughs> Valde in that situation, right? Like Valde pushed up with that smoke. Yeah, gosh. That was like a, that move should have negated what VP wanted to do. That would have left them with the no timing. real estate. They would have been stuck in white walls. They couldn't have done a single thing. There's an entry. There's an opening. Here we go again. Double O two. Not too much to hold snacks at bay for that peak. In fact, no Molotov at all arriving to silence oh, the, the Ivy push. Warp line. And we are going to be seeing action on Ivy bomb. And a frag found for PHR. Is, is this going to walk into this? He yeah. Why? Is. Why? Don't know. Oh. Why do they keep pushing And everyone? so, a one versus three now. Valder. Known to, to win Save these. the day. And known to win them. Already we said he's first. a closer. He's known to win them. Come on, OG. Get a win on the board, boys. <laughs> it doesn't look good. We just want to see, you know, the new walk. You know, we want we want to. He's going to do it. He's going to do it. He's going to do it. Oh. He's going to do it. So low. Oh, the incendiary as well. Throw it. Throw it, throw it, throw it. He's fucked. I don't think it's not. Oh, it's no, he's, he's done, done it. it. He's, done it. he's done it. Three on oh, one. Oh, it took on everything they had. It wasn't looking good for Al, but it will be OG with their first ever, ever win. map victory here. It's D-Train, their opponent's pick. They've done it. They've broken the goose egg, and we'll find ourselves in a much better position. That could have been a nightmare. That's far out of control considering the score yeah. they had in regulation. Maybe it's like, you know, when you go, you're go, you out at a night drinking and you don't want to break the seal, so you don't go take a piss. Yeah. And now they've taken a piss, the seal's broken, the and they'll all open. just be victories now. Yeah, it should be. Could be possible. Could okay, be. I kind of like the way you're thinking. They're playing G2 next, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's the next game. Difficult one. Yeah, it's, you, it's going to be a really hard You kind of really hope with like, the hype behind this team, they'd be taking down VP in this current form, but they got a map. It was yeah. overtime the first. Well, I think people are just putting a lot of stock in the names of without course. actually because yeah. like coming into that thing. You're putting your spotlight on yourself, getting the biggest like org available, yeah. all these names. Like, of course, there's going to be some pressure coming with that. It's like joining phase, you know, like yeah, sure, whole thing. yeah, like yeah, poor little Brokey.
Yeah. Although they're in a Neo joint phase, right? Like imagine like you think, oh yeah, this would be a really stable team. No, you're gonna have the spotlight on you the entire time because of the org, the prestige, and the hype around the squad. Mm. Like, I feel like this comes in the territory when you join an organization like this. Yeah, and I think it's also just exciting for the community because it's like it's such a you know, a band of misfits. Like yeah. not yeah. these are not characters you were expected to ever you know, this this is not a timeline you were expecting of Issa, NBK. A lot of this Valdi, happens, right? You know, like it's a it's whole good. yeah, exactly. The, the these jumbled these jumbled teams, like it's a surprise for people and they're excited. Hey, Nate, if you want to hang out? Uh, yeah. yeah. I mean, I've been told to come here. Oh, oh okay. No. Well, well, you well, want to well, come well, hang well, out well, with well, us? Because, yeah, go, go sit down. The, the, facade, chill, bro, the, facade's, yeah. the facade's been, been ruined now. now. I've been told. I, I, I have, to. have to be I here. have to spend time with you. All right, well, damn, dude. Shit, man. I get it, I guess. And he's getting comfortable, yeah. Wonderful. There we go. There we go. Yeah. First, yeah, first victory. Yeah, first victory. Um... I don't know. I, I'm, I still have mixed feelings because okay. uh, it's. Uh, I mean, it's good to s to win. Yeah, but didn't uh, look like a comfortable victory. It was like, labor. It looked stressful. It, it and the fact you had that like, regulation, it was like looking pretty good. You would close it out, then it goes over time. That's what it be. I, I think it was pretty much the same on the Mirage. To be yeah, fair, yeah, it was. And like, it, it's very hard mentally because, for example, Alexi and me, we come from teams where we had like all that basis and all that experience built up, and it, it can get pretty frustrating because a lot of stupid mistakes that are happening. Sure. But, uh, I mean, it's a start. Maybe it's going to unlock something where we're just going to feel more comfortable, more confident, stuff like that. You can definitely see on your T-sides, I get the not lack of preparation, it's lack of time to really bring much to the table there. Like, a lot of contact plays, like not yeah. much in terms of execution. Is that what you're just kind of focusing on? It's just kind of just trade out, just use fundamentals here, that's all we can really do? Yeah, it's a bit hard to play full on defaults. Yeah. But to be fair, the main thing that is a problem right now, and it was the case uh, yesterday when we lost against Mouse, yeah. uh, is just the space we're not taking on the map. Because... So Lexi said the same thing, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's pretty straightforward, and like that's pure basic for Counter-Strike that we have to just pile on 24-7, uh, because it's not something that is natural at the moment. Like mm. there's a lot of lurking plays and stuff like that. So um, everyone yeah, has to be on the same page. Yeah, pretty much. Like it's we come from five different backgrounds, five different teams, five different nationalities. So like everything is very different for everyone. And so we just have to like adapt everyone to what we want to do, what mm. Alexi wants to do in his game plan, and then in the mid rounds just be straightforward. How, how is everyone working. handling the whole English situation? Like I I can imagine for you it's no problem. They have the boys haven't been in English speaking yeah. teams or had that much experience. Has it become challenging at this point? Um. I think probably the mo for the person that is the most frustrating is probably going to be Alexi because yeah. he has some very specific ideas and as an in-game leader. Okay. And so um, obviously at this level it all comes down to details, timings, and stuff like that. So when yeah. he has to explain on the fly, the uh, just like small things that you have to change in some rounds or timings, that's when it gets a bit more frustrating for him because yeah. we have to like adapt 100% like to really understand. But I mean English is not really a problem. Everybody has good English and yeah. especially in game. But again, it's like being on the same page. If you want to do a contact play or do a specific things, you have to have names for everything. So you have to create that's lots of the theory, right? Language oh, yeah. of counter yeah. like Everyone has to be speaking it very fluently. The same, same way. language, yes, yeah. yeah, exactly. Yeah, so it can get frustrating, but I mean, we're, we're working towards there. Like, this event is a great place for us to be under pressure and know yeah, exactly so. what to do and then to yeah. move forward and work, uh, work better. Mantu, by the way, what a oh, find! Yeah. He's fragging <laughs> now, he's fragging his socks off right now. Yeah, I mean, I think he's getting more and more comfortable, yeah, um, more and more confident within the team as well to do his own thing. And like, I mean, he's very aggressive, so we try to give him that space. Mm -hmm. And um, and yeah, we have Alexi and me in front just uh, taking the damage, taking everything, and then the three others that are just coming out in front. What's the story? How did you guys get introduced to him? Um, fairly simple. Uh, NKJ that is right now yeah. coaching for alternate attacks. Sprout. No. Oh, that's right. Yeah, he, he went from attacks to Sprout. That's G right. Yeah. 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 He yeah was, he's he gone. He's flipped all over the yeah. German scene recently. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. And so he was playing. I mean, he was coaching Mantu, and then when the whole thing was happening, he just uh, tipped me off. Like, yeah, look out for that guy. Maybe try him out. Something like this. And um, and I mean, to me, like, I, I can have a good feeling as to what a player has or not in terms of like intuition and like tight yeah. situation, how he reacts and all that kind of stuff. And so the skill is pretty evident and I like how he re reacts in a lot of tight situations. Was and and that's, that's what I like about him. And like, I think that he has that thing. So he was secondary upper and now he's coming in uh, as a main upper. Okay. Ooh, but he's like, he's a very smart person. So adapting and learning is pretty natural to him. So um, so I'm very confident that he's going to pull everything off, although people don't really know. Are you enjoying not being necessarily an in-game leader right now? Like having someone who's dedicated in that role? Or because you've got some people that have been experienced. You've got Valerie sure, yeah. yourself. Uh, Alexi, obviously, at the, the range right now. Has there been any complications in that respect? Have you felt like you wanted to jump in and just had to kind of keep quiet? Yeah, I mean, for me personally, it's like I know how to 
switch the flip, uh, flip the switch. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, I, I know how to do that very naturally. So like I know when I just don't talk, and like as soon as yeah. we started playing, I just don't talk anymore. Like that's over. For Valde, for example, it's a bit harder because he was leading 100% in everything, and he had to direct the yeah. same way. So it's a bit harder for him to get into that zone, but right. I mean... It seems like he has his own out. roles and objectives almost on the map. Like on saw and train, him just pushing inside like a lot by himself yeah. on the T side, right? Just a lot trying of to players. find wiggle and some space by himself almost. Right, yeah. I mean, uh, Valle is going to be our hard lurker yeah. pretty much. So like um, we need to just bring him to when he was challenging to being the best player in the world. Sure. Yeah. And I mean, I think he's just starting that. And then again, like his lurk is going to be more efficient the better we're going to be at taking zones with the yeah. attack group and taking areas and stuff like that. And, and that's when we're going to gain more efficiency. But now the main point is just basis, basis, basis. We don't have like a billion things in our playbook. It's yeah. just about trading, how to take map control, taking space, communication, all that kind of stuff. And yeah. then we're going to build on that. Just a personal one for you. Are you not fed up of starting from scratch every single time now? It's been the last two teams. Yeah, I mean, um, yes and no, uh, where it felt good to be back in those big invites roles. <laughs> and that sure, kind of stuff. Yeah. So, like, it felt very good to have passed that. Um, but I mean, right now, like I wanted to go already international last year, but it was not really like the right opportunity. Yeah. And um, and like for the first, let's say, six, seven years of my career I was like in the mentality where I want to destroy everyone and, and fuck all the others and mm -hmm. I don't really care. And now, like the past two or three years, I'm much more into building a roster, building things together, and, and creating something, and like bringing other players up and stuff like that. So uh, yeah, I mean, it's frustrating for sure, and like, especially having to go through the whole major road when yeah, we made right. it all, and like it's super complicated. Where I mean, the minor is going to be ridiculous. Yeah, gosh, um, that's going to be scary on this year. Yeah, isn't it? it's going to be crazy. crazy. Yeah. Uh, especially because so the roster changes as well. Yeah, yeah. Well, What's next so. for you guys now? Um, this is the last event of the year, I assume. Yes, um, uh, we're not sure to be honest. So okay. um, we've been working pretty intensely. Like there has been like two months of trouble to like putting the team together. Yeah, of course. And all that kind of stuff. <laughs> yeah. So like that was really hard mentally, and like we only had a few time to just work on stuff. And um, and so just taking a break, reset completely, and then 2020 is the big objective and like growing throughout the year. I mean, nice. we don't we don't expect to be winning tournaments straight off the bat. That's not what we want to do, but it's just like a constant grind. I mean, 2020 is the real objective. Yeah. And like here is just a test to know the direction for the next year. Yeah. So uh, I, I think I think it's the right approach. I think we have to let ourselves time because teams that are established cannot be taken down very easily. Mm -hmm. You can brawl against them and like win one game or two, but like it's it's gonna be pretty random. You can do that all the time. What if you want to grind and get better? Yeah. You have to start with the basis and build on that. And and so that's that's the the only objective and then see what we do if we just keep Alexi full-time leader if we double lead or all that kind of stuff all those things are like up in the air nobody is really closed and so everybody has their role we can swap things around and um, everybody's pretty finding the right working. mix right wow. yeah pretty much I mean we have to create something from scratch which is something that very few rosters have been doing and if you look at mouse for example they had a, a basis but still it took him eight months to win uh, a very big tournament sure, yeah. so I mean we give ourselves some time but the end goal is obviously to win are you excited for the G2 game? Uh, yes, uh, playing my big boy, yeah. Kenny. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it, it's going to be a great game. Um, we know fairly well how they play. Sure. Um, and, and yeah, I think I think we can just. Like you, you've had a lot Kenny. of you've had a lot of close games here. They've been good games at least, right? So hopefully we'll see you get a couple more wins. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's the plan. Yeah. The doors are open win. now. Picking oh, up the yeah. first one there, they go I think one and three right now. So one hopefully you can yep, see a couple correct. more picked up today. And uh, thank you so much, Nate, for coming for on. Sure. That is lovely Anytime. stuff. We're we'll gonna take back. a break and come back with G two versus OG very shortly. We'll see you there. Oh, hold up a oh. second. We have uh, there's a, there's a, a <coughs> I got ahead of myself. We just need to. I do thought we meant yellow card is the referee. No, we need yeah, to yeah, spot, a, spot, a sponsor we'll call out here. Right, this on, one, uh, this one here. Thank you to our sponsors, Monster for keeping us energized. Sennheiser, the premium gaming audio provider. XPG, our official keyboard sponsor. You can see this lovely ten thousand dollar gold keyboard just here. Uh, and Betway, the betting sponsor of CS Summit Five. That'll be it from the sponsors. And now we can get to that break. We'll see you shortly. We will indeed. Ciao.